Good morning. Today, I need to make some more shibori masks. And I dyed my fabric the other day. And today, I need to uh, sharpen my blade on my rotary cutter. And this is one of those don't try this at home things. I actually have a new set of blades on order, but they are not here yet. And so I'm taking my knife sharpener from my kitchen and I am carefully sharpening the edge of this rotary cutter so that I can use it a little longer until the new one arrives. Actually, it's a new set other than one, which is always good. It's always good to order more than one of something. And when you're down to that last one, reorder. So that was the coarse side. And here is the fine. I love a rotary cutter, especially when I'm making these protective face masks, because really everything is a square. It's sort of like if you're a quilter and you're cutting a lot of straight lines, it's much easier to cut pressing down and you can use a ruler as a guide if you wish and get a nice straight cut. Curves are a little harder, but you can do that too. And I also really like a rotary cutter. God, I have no idea if that's good. Uh, I like a rotary cutter when cutting garments because, again, you can press down. And if you if you are in a situation where you pin a pattern to fabric and then you need to pick up the edge to slide your scissor, uh, that's a different thing. And you, you definitely change the cutting. You're going to add an eighth of an inch here and there. And, of course... We all know in the world of sewing, we know it is measure twice and cut once. Yes? Okay, so let's see if I remember how to put this puppy back together. Looks like I'm doing okay. Whoops, keeping my, how about this? How about I retract the blade? Genius, Rand, genius. Again, don't try this at home. And I will take a little corner of my fabric and let's see if I can tell the difference. Rats, it still has a, a spot that isn't gonna be easy. So it'll take going over it a couple times, which you can see gives you like a little bit of a messy edge. And, uh, as a seamstress, I am compulsive. And of course, as a jeweler, I'm compulsive. So I don't like those messy edges, but what are you going to do? So thank you. That was me sharpening. Again, don't try it at home. Really don't try it because it doesn't seem to have worked. Thank you. Have a fabulous day. Stay safe and healthy. Take good care of each other. Ciao.